at 11, would you want your neighborhood to look like this? An RTV6 viewer reached out for help, hoping someone will finally do something to clean up what's become a dumping ground on the far east side of Indianapolis. And only RTV6's Graham Hunter is answering that viewer's call for help, finding out this has been a problem for years. Welcome to the unofficial city dump. If you've ever driven along 46th Street between Midhoffer and North German Church Roads, you've probably seen it. Maybe you've even watched someone throw a seemingly innocent cup out the window. Well, it's starting to pile up, and some of the folks who live out here that we talked to have had enough. Basically, it's just an open dumping ground. Brian Day has lived near 46th Street for five years and says he has watched people leave their junk on the side of the road. Guy jumped back in a truck, drove forward, it all fell off, and jumped back in the truck and took off. He's seen a lot of junk pile up near his home. But I've seen living room sets, big screen TVs, small TVs, um, washers and dryers. We even saw a propane tank hidden in the trees and this stuff marked with a cone that says IPL. I asked IPL if they left it but never heard back. The stretch of road technically sits in Lawrence, but the city of Indianapolis has cited property owners on both sides of 46th Street in the past for trash cleanup. Our calls to both cities went unreturned. Day says he has seen the mess cleaned up in the past. Within 24 hours, there's another pile of crap down there. He just wants it to stop. Please do not dump here. You know, this is our neighborhood. He knows there's a better way. Spend the 10 bucks, 15 bucks, and go dump it, man, please. I mean, it makes it look like crap around here. A pickup truck load of regular trash at the Marion County Transfer Station costs just five bucks. That includes items like tires without rims. I don't think anything will ever come of it. I mean, it's just people are going to continue to dump down here. Reporting from the Far East Side, Graham Hunter, RTV6. And we are still learning to work to learn who exactly is responsible for that cleanup. We'll keep pressing for answers to get help for that community.